You really can't judge a book by its cover. Who'd have thought that sweet-looking girl would threaten to destroy herself? Didn't she realize taking her own life would mean the boy died too? Oh, she knew exactly what she was doing. The whole thing was a bluff then? No, not at all. The reason she gave her core crystal to the boy was to replace his heart after Jin put paid to it. An Aegis core encodes the blueprints for all life. She took advantage of that. Incredible. I had no idea such a thing was possible. Aegis's truly are a breed apart. Cores are constantly accumulating data about the outside world. The fact that their injuries are mirrored is a result of their twin cores exchanging information. If you wanted to be poetic about it, you could say that their very lives are intertwined. But there's nothing to stop her from severing that link. What do you mean? Before issuing the kill order to the artifice, she would have transferred the remainder of her core to the boy. Letting him live on, heart complete. An Aegis can survive for a short time without a core crystal. Don't ask me why. It's just how we were made. Ah, so that's the reason Jin agreed to her terms. He couldn't care less about the boy. But he wasn't about to lose this one. Simple as that. <laughs>